It's the start of February across North Texas, and we're starting it off with a pretty active pattern that's continuing into today, and that is winter weather. Today is going to be one of our last winter weather alert days as winter weather is expected from today into tonight and early into tomorrow, and then eventually it should tamper off as we head into tomorrow afternoon activity-wise. But for now, we're starting off with Highs in the upper 20s for DFW, slightly cooler the farther north and northwest you go, and then areas along and south of I-20 should be warmer in the lower 30s for highs today. I'll show you the almanac right underneath the banner. Our average temperature for February is around 65, and as you can tell, we are well below that for highs today across north Texas, so it's going to be a cold one, and make sure if you're going to travel Make sure you do so with extreme caution, but we highly discourage travel today, uh, especially with an ice storm warning for parts of the area. So travel if only absolutely necessary today. Otherwise, it's a good day and a good night to stay indoors. Take a look at the night, uh, the overnight lows for tonight across North Texas. 25 is going to be our low once again tonight. So it is going to be a cold and active night activity-wise. So pretty much frozen precipitation is going to continue uh, over the next 24 hours or so. So make sure, like I said, don't travel if you absolutely don't have to. And here's a look at our winter precipitation chances for today. As you can see, expected across North Texas. We fully upgraded to expected just because uh, we already have quite a bit of activity this morning moving across the region. So it is a fair assumption that we're just going to continue to see that. Uh, especially for areas along I-35 and just slightly to the west where we had that ice storm warning in effect. So it is going to be, like we said, a cold and even hazardous travel day across North Texas. Speaking of uh, hazardous travel conditions, we're going to show you real quick the travel impacts across North Texas that you can see here. We have upgraded to expected for areas where the ice storm warning uh, has been issued, but we've also slightly uh, branched that expected area into the DFW area and the reason for that is we've already seen some videos of people getting stranded on the bridges in Dallas County uh, across Dallas and we already had those impacts yesterday we're going to we're going to continue to see those impacts into today so it is going to be a like we said hazardous travel day so only travel if absolutely necessary today uh, otherwise stay indoors because if you're on the roads there's the potential for slick spots you could get stuck like we saw on some area bridges yesterday but also take into consideration you might be paying attention to the road but that doesn't mean that other drivers around you are doing the same so it's you got a mix of the hazardous travel conditions and then also you have a mix of dangerous drivers who may not be paying attention or might be speeding or all these other factors that could put uh, other drivers uh, in danger on the road too so just because you're paying attention doesn't mean that other drivers are doing the same thing so it's just it's 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 a good idea to stay home uh, today so really there's not a lot to it yesterday's forecast we know was a little bit long it was almost about eight minutes but we had so much to talk about uh, you can see the warnings and the w advisories and watches with our map on the live weather channel that's updating constantly. Uh, so check that throughout the day for any updates to any alerts. But today, weather alert day for winter weather, freezing rain potential, hazardous driving is ex uh, hazardous driving condition. Excuse me, is expected. Please don't be on the roads if you don't need to. It's a good day to stay indoors. Tomorrow, slight warm up, but not by much. But at least we're above freezing for the afternoon highs with a 50% chance of showers across the area. Then finally, we've got much more. Uh, pleasant weather on the way Friday through at least Monday as we eventually make our way to our average high around Monday and then take a look with warmer weather brings other types of weather hazards and we're talking thunderstorms but before we get too into that we don't want anyone uh, worrying just because we just got through this stressful weather system we're not going to say that there's a severe weather threat or anything like this for Tuesday. As it looks now, there might be a low-end risk for maybe some gusty winds, but this is just your typical springtime thunderstorm as it looks now, but stay tuned for the latest. But we're going to get through the system, and then we can focus on rain chances and thunderstorm chances coming up on next Tuesday. Make sure you download the free Weather 225 mobile app today. We've been putting updates and alerts out as they uh, come in to the weather wire and stuff like that. Uh, so we're giving you the latest information. You have access to our live weather channel 24 seven 
all of our forecasts are in one place so you can find those easily we've got a bunch of graphs that we update uh, every day so make sure that you check that out we got a lot of helpful weather tools road conditions you name it uh, it's free on Google Play and on the Apple App Store just look up weather 225 also make sure because it is going to be a more pleasant pattern Friday through Monday that you give our friends a call or click today at my pro construction and roofing for any sort of repairs to the roof of your home or commercial building or if you need a new roof in general give them a call today and refer weather 225 more information for them is going to be on the slide after this so stay tuned for that make sure that you also download that free weather 225 mobile app and also make sure that you don't travel if you don't have to today just because of those slick roads otherwise have a fantastic day north texas thank you again for tuning into these forecasts i'm joshua weisel have a great day Whether it's sunny, stormy, or snowy in North Texas, be sure to download our free Weather 225 mobile app.